Nitenam guys, welcome back. Um, I have a nice picture for you here or there. <laughs> we'll see where it comes. I found this picture. Um, it is in picture which is uh, in the Vaishnavite tradition, in the tradition of uh, Vaishnavism. So basically, people who worship Paramashiva in the form of Maha Vishnu. And, um, and I thought this picture is amazing and I wanted to share the clicks and the understanding I got when I saw this picture. So before that, I welcome you all with my love and respects and the blessings of my Guru, His Divine Holiness, Bhagwan Shinityanda Paramashiva. So this picture is depicting what happens when you die and why it is important, or at least that's, that's the click I'm sharing when I saw this picture. Why is it important to get the initiation of Guru? And how this initiation comes to your rescue when you leave the body. So in this picture, we have an old man leaving the body. And he is, as you can see, uh, entangled. His soul, which is coming out of him, that's the, that's the soul coming out, is entangled by demons. And demons are pulling. Uh, they're actually the Yamadutas, which are basically the embodiment of the servants of Yama, which is the Lord of Death, which are coming to take the soul to its next journey. So when you did not manifest Paramashivam in your life, when you leave the body, you feel, you do not feel oneness with Paramashiva. Obviously, you feel separated. So naturally, it is a time for you to make a decision to go to take the next body and continue the cycle of life and death, reincarnation. So the Yamadutas, the, the servants of Yama, of death, come and take you so that you proceed into the process of taking the new birth. But if you get initiated with the uh, powerful cognition by a guru, with the powerful cognition of Paramashivoham, like Swamiji is doing by initiating us into Om Nityananda Paramashivoham, the guru is responsible to make that initiation successful in you. Now, as long as you do not destroy the feeling connection by, by abusing the Guru, that initiation will save you. If you take that initiation and become integrated to it while you exist, then you will be a living, enlightened being, a Jivan Mukti, Jivan Mukta. If you do not fully integrate yourself to it, then when you leave the body, uh, you will have an option. You will be tended to take the new body, but this initiation will come and intervene. And in this picture, we see how um, uh, Vishnu and uh, Devas and uh, come and protect the being. They come to take, to remove the Yamadutas, to protect the being from death, so that he goes and rests into, uh, into the space of Mahavishnu, into the space of Paramashivoham. And, and that is the power of Guru, and that is the power of initiation. When you get initiated and you do not abuse the Guru, you do not destroy the feeling connection, the Guru is responsible. He committed to you. And when I say you, to your being, he committed to your being that I am liberated and I will liberate you. Now, in the worst case scenario, if you do not get liberated while you live, you will get liberated when you leave the body. And that's what's happening here. So because of his integrity to his commitment, the Guru will come and take you into the space of enlightenment, the space from which he operates. So I think it's a beautiful picture. And I think, like I said, Hinduism or Sanatana Dharma is very deep. It's very deep. But you need to have time to digest it. You should not come to conclusion too fast. Whether you're born Hindu or not, uh, Sanatana Hindu Dharma is something that you need to discover and experience for yourself. And it is extremely beautiful, extremely rich and it leads to the ultimate powerfulness. So that's what I want to share in this video. And again, whether you understand the power of Guru or not in your life, that is your thing. But do not abuse. Do not come to conclusions too fast. Don't be silly. Don't have immature conversation with life and yourself and abuse Guru because you don't get what is going on. Have patience, have seeking, have surrender, have prayerfulness, and you will get it because ultimately, he is there to shower. Guru is there to shower onto us. So with this, I am seeing you guys in the next video. Like, comment, subscribe. And if you have any uh, interesting, perhaps when you see this picture, what do you see? You can share that in the comments below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Nityananda.